Siemens Engine business was born in 1966 as a familiar company, so we have reached already over 50 years of history. We began building a wide range of diesel engines and then we started producing gas engines too. The engine business entered Siemens Group in 2015 and this was a very important milestone for our business. In the Siemens engine business, we see a great opportunity to combine the history and the legacy of Guascor and combine that with the, with the power of the Siemens brand. Siemens is known around the world for industrial power generation and we want to take advantage of that but also bring together the great technology and the flexibility that comes about from the Guascor brand. Siemens engines are present in a very wide range of applications. We develop our best-in-class solutions for power generation, co-generation, three generation, waste to energy, oil and gas solutions, industrial buildings, etc. Our gas engines can run with a very large range of different fuels, different gases, from boot gas or syn gas, through biogas, natural gas, low methane number gases, propane, etc. We are present as well in the marine application with our diesel and gas engines for propulsion and power generation in the ships. Marine for us, well, we still have a, a strong portfolio in diesel engines for propulsion applications and for power generation applications. And we've also been innovating with gas because also the marine world needs to improve emissions. So therefore, we've been taking the innovative step and in releasing a gas engine for marine applications. The world of electricity generation is changing and it's changing forever. Why? Because we need to be more resource efficient and we, be, we need to make sure that we reduce emissions. And therefore, a more renewable future results in a need for power generation, thermal power generation, to be more flexible and to be more local. And for that reason, we see decentralized energy as being the big future of electricity. It is a reality that today, the large gas engines are becoming more and more important in the power generation market. There are several reasons. The first one that comes into my mind is the fact that gas produces significantly less contaminants. We are talking about 10 times less NOx and particles and also 30% less CO2. So this is a big advantage. At the same time, gas engines are achieving very high efficiencies and gensets in general can also, uh, let's say, uh, work in combination with other technologies, for example, renewables. The Siemens engine business, we see a future where we were going to, we're going to grow our, our business through more business partners, enter into more markets and to grow using our new 2 megawatt engine, to, which is the benchmark in electrical efficiency in the 2 megawatt range. And this is our path to growth. One of the priorities for the Siemens engine business in the next year is to achieve profitable growth. In order to be there, we have defined a new go-to-market strategy. We want to improve and increase our network of distributors. We also want to leverage the global footprint of Siemens and to improve our direct channels by offering turnkey solutions in power plants business based on gas engines. We have recently launched the new E-Series gas engine that is able to deliver 2 megawatt power with a best-in-class efficiency. We are talking about a 45.4% electrical efficiency. It is for the power generation and combined heat power applications and it also complies with the latest emission regulations. It can go down to 200 milligrams per noble cubic meter NOx which is very low at a very stable combustion. In this research and development center, we are covering all the development process of engines. We are covering from design, calculation, simulations to the final test of the product. We have 22 test beds. Those test beds are covering basic tests of combustion concepts in the single cylinder engines, but also they are covering the final performance tests of the, of the final prototype and also the final endurance test. So we are just uh, releasing to the client not only uh, a high performance engine, but a high reliability as well. Uh, between those, I would uh, put the note in, in a couple of them that uh, from the perspective of clients are really giving a good benefit for, for them. And those are the fast response engines, which are engines that are capable of giving full power as quick as diesel engines. They can be at full load in, within 30 seconds since they are getting the, the request from the grid. And also uh, another application that has been uh, very important that is also based in flexibility, a different kind of flexibility, not really the fast response, but a flexibility that is covering in this case a fuel flexibility. Our engines are working with natural gas, with sewage gas, landfill, propane, different gases, 
And in some cases, clients are asking to have a system that is capable of mixing them, and that mixing system uh, has to be able of being done not before starting the engine, but also during the engine working period, even at full load. In Siemens, customer satisfaction and customer service is key. It's so much of who we are and how, and how we work. We have a great advantage in the Siemens engine business insofar as we are here located in two facilities in the north of Spain and you can always find the expert, the person who knows about the technology and that is so close and available at your hand. And also a key part of our customer focus is our flexibility. We are able to be really tailored and focused in delivering solutions which are bespoke for customers and that's again so much part of the DNA of our business. We have four step process to achieve a better effective learning. We go from the basic, going through the operations. We offer as well maintenance services, trainings, and the most expert trainings that we offer is the technical service. Siemens' most valuable resource is its employees. There is no other aspect in, in the company most important than that. So at Siemens, through our zero harm culture, which means zero incidents, we promote a preventive attitude towards risk. Our management is fully committed to, to this. When uh, we are not a big, big company, but just a medium-sized one in the Siemens engine business, it's very important for all the members of the team to have a clear picture of, of which is the final application of that product in order to develop something that is uh, really requested by the market. And I really think that we have a team that is capable of giving that and even more.